a Jamaican brother and praise the Lord that he walked here. We love the flavor, you know. And the Bible know. bashing and left. No, I will not stand for any rubbish. Okay. okay. He's taking he a back seat. Thank you, sir. That I hate. Okay, sin. daddy. He daddy. No, that I want okay. to tell you the truth. Let's have a debate, sir. Daddy. Because you shall know the truth. Daddy, do you believe and that? The truth daddy. Shall make you free. Thank you very much. You smoked this morning, of course you did. I know you did. Know. <laughs> daddy, tell me something. Tell me something. <laughs> do you believe that Jesus Christ is God? I do believe. If you believe, and now we're, now we're talking about the Bible for a little while, we'll get back to politics in five minutes. If you believe that Jesus Christ is God, who was your Jesus praying to on the cross when he was being crucified? And he said, Eli, Eli, lama sabachthani. My God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? If your Jesus was God, why would he be praying to another God? His father. Yeah. Because he and his because, father. Because he'd be he his, father. his father. Oh, so God has a father. <laughs> he and his father. God has a father. And so ah, was now we, now we have the backup forces. Why don't you come down the front of the <laughs> My friend, the idiots are over here. Come get all together. That's it. My, let me, my friend, there's one idiot to another idiot. Just introduction. <laughs> now we have one brain cell, one brain cell, one plus one equals two brain cells. And if you're good, you can put them together and we can argue. Oh, wow. Thank you, brother. The argument is before you caught up was if Jesus was God, who was he praying to when he said, Eli, Eli, Lama Sabachthani, my God, my God, why hast thou forsaken me? Why don't you consult? Well, I can give you a very simple answer. Okay. When we talk about God, we are talking about a supernatural being. We are talking about supernatural being. God cannot being. be counted. Are you one, saying two, ghosts? Three, four. Are you talking about ghosts? You see, that is the ignorance that you have, that you have no knowledge. No, sir. The word supernatural infers spiritual, meaning Absolutely. ghost. Absolutely. So, and in fact, no, in no, fact, no. hold on, sir. Only one person at a time, super. one person at a time, in fact, you even call him the Holy Ghost. But now you have a problem with me using the term I ghost. I do not you have a problem with you. So, uh, using the term supernatural. Of course, of course you can't have a problem with me. I go out with your sister. a supreme being. <laughs> A supreme being. So what do you mean? God is omnipotent. You said supernatural. Omnipotent. I said ghost. He says God is omniscient, meaning all-knowing. God is omnipotent, meaning all-powerful. So tell me, sir, 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 one fool at a time. He's first. One fool at a time. He's first. Wait your turn. He's first. Let me deal with him first. Now, sir, the question was, if if Jesus was God, who was he praying to? This man said he was praying to the Father. So can I simply ask you, does that mean that your God has a Father? And how can a God have a Father? I will, very confused, I will explain it and I'll give you a very simple example. Give me a very simple example. Sir, you got a body. I have a body. Soul and spirit. Soul and spirit. And one Sounds thing like is, some lovers rock too. And one thing is, there are three that bear record in heaven. There are three the that Father, bear record The Father, the heaven. Word and the Spirit. The Father, the Word and the Spirit. Can you try and be a little more vague? I can't be vague because you see, your understanding is so narrow concerning the things of the Spirit. Why do we get That's into this why abstract you have talk? No clue. A talk we can't you debate. You don't have a clue about Sir, what Sir, how do we about. debate the realm of this metaphysics? How do we go? How do we do it? The you, spirit, the, what are we debating? I tell you, sir, you cannot use logic in the things of God. Always. We can't use logic in the things of the God. You're very right. It is by logic. faith should that we you use, can please Should we God. be illogical then? Well, my friend, if you want to if know, we can't use logic, do you want to know about God? Do I want to know? Of course, of you want. I, I want to know about. You want I want to know. to know about everything. You want to know about everything. I want to know about everything. The first I'm, thing, I'm inquisitive. The first thing you have to do right now. The first thing. Get on your knee. I'm gonna pray for you. Get down on and my knees and pray. Take off your funny glass. Now he's asking me. Now he's asking me to take to step down and kneel down in front of his penis. All right. <laughs> you know. You know. That really is a test of faith, brother. The trouble really is, brother. The trouble now, is, brother. Can't I believe? The trouble that. is, you are thinking you the wrong it? way. You see? And you are holding the wrong thing, sir. Hold on. And you wear a wrong thing at now the same my brother, time, sir. My brother, this fool was here before you. He's not so, a fool. Who am I to call you? You're right, Yonah. Sir, a fool. what do you have to say about this point? Because we have to include them also equal well, rights. If I, if I ask you the logical question. If you ask me the logical question. I hope, be consistent. I hope he you, says you can't be logical. I and now this one says he wants to ask me the logical I question. Hope you will my friend, be consistent. 
And this man says you can't deal with the logical. You're and you says we I have am, to be logical. I am going to ask you the logical. Logical. Question. Okay. I want to ask you. And I want you to answer. Under whose permission are you standing here? Under whose permission am I standing here? I suppose by the decree of the Queen. See, I mean, she's the one who's made this space open for us to speak here, and we have this free space since 1781. Ah, ah so it's by the... Are you confused by that? No, because you're not, you still not have the right answer. Because I still don't have the right answer. You mean I don't have the answer that you want to hear? No? Okay, let me tell you. The reason why I have the right to speak here is because God gave me that right. Hallelujah, brothers and sisters. Hallelujah. God gave me the right. Look, even he's leaving you now. Even he says he can't take more of this shit. Now you're by yourself, motherfucker. Now you're by yourself. Look, even he had enough of you. Even your own Christian brothers had enough of you. Why couldn't you have been you? Let me ask you one more question. One more question before I know you have to go. <laughs> Let me ask you one more question, sir. Sir, you believe that your Jesus Christ died for you, for me, and rose again, and for everyone, and, and everyone here, and the people we can't see as well, <laughs> and those at home. And what without, you say? without him, we <laughs> shall our life rise. Hallelujah, please the Lord. Now, now, Daddy, answer me this question. You believe that Jesus Christ died and rose again after three days? And three nights. So that you might have life. Do you believe that? Do you believe that? For your sake. Do you believe that? For your Do you believe that? Do you believe that? For your. Do you believe that? I believe with all my. So heart. if you believe, if you believe that your God died for three days and three nights, who was ruling the earth when your God died? <laughs> Did he hand over to someone? Did he give it over to John Prescott? Was it Nick Clegg? That guy, you can't put none past Nick. Good looking brother like that. The same one that was ruling his family created. Sorry? The same one that was ruling his family created. Now tell me, sir, here's the question to you again. Tell me, sir, where is the prophecy revealed in your Bible that your Jesus, your God died for three days? Where is it? What does it say? Just like you just said. What does it say in your Bible? Died for three days and raised and Where does it? And what does it say? Where's the prophecy in your and Bible? He's alive. Because he doesn't know his Bible. And he's alive. Where is it in your Bible? And Let me tell you why I know your Bible. I know your Bible because when I was 10 years old, my mother said to me, I wanted a guitar. And she's a Christian, devout Christian. She said, if you learn the Bible, I will buy you a guitar. I read the Bible cover to cover, word for word, not once, but twice. Glad you Hallelujah. Know. I know your Bible inside out. Glad you know. So tell me, sir, glad you know. where is the prophecy in your Bible? I'm glad you know. You don't know, do you? I'm glad you know. What's the prophecy say? I'm glad you know. What does the prophecy say? I'm glad you know that. It doesn't say, I'm glad you know. What does your prophecy say? One fool made men. What does your no, prophecy no, no. say? One fool made men. What does your prophecy say? My prophecy says, one fool made men. Oh. Here's what your prophecy says. Your prophecy says, one just fool your prophecy men. says so. You might learn from this. Get out your pen and paper. Get out your pen and paper. The prophecy All says, you shall likewise. The prophecy says, sir. Perish. The prophecy says. Just as I Jonah spent three days and three nights in the belly of the whale, so too shall the Son of Man when spend three appears. days and three nights when in the will, belly of the earth. Oh, now, yeah. sir, when he now, sir, appear. when he will appear. You now, know. you claim that your Jesus... Sir, is close now. that's why you never learn nothing in school, because you're talking over your teacher. You don't, you don't listen. My friend, you don't listen. my friend, your Bible tells you your Jesus Christ was crucified on the start of the Sabbath, a Friday night. And your Jesus Christ rose again at the end of the Sabbath, on a Sunday morning. From Friday night to Sunday morning is one and a half days, not three days and three nights. Your Jesus Christ woke early. Your Jesus Christ should have woken on Tuesday. So who was it that rose on Sunday? one question, and then I will leave you. 
Can I Why did you just leave me now? Can I ask you to leave me now? Do you believe that the wages of sin is death? Do I believe that the wages of sin is death? But the gift wow. of God is eternal life. But the gift of life is eternal life. Tell me. Sir, I would rather perish than live for eternity with you in heaven. <laughs> I don't think... I, I sir, didn't sir, with me. sir I you. if I go to heaven and see you up there, we're going to have bloody problems. <laughs> I'm going to kick you off your cloud, motherfucker. Can I, <laughs> can I repeat it again? Do you 